Hello everybody, this is Mustafa from GearTech and in today's tutorial we're gonna go over a method that shows you how to fix the USB issue that you cannot get it detected on your virtual box and in my example I'm using Kali Linux and for some people they have the Ubuntu operating system and they cannot get it to run on that. So um, I have my USB already plugged in so I would like to show it to you. It's right over here. It says my USB and I have these files on here. So what most people will do, they'll go over here, devices, USB, and then this is the name of my USB flash drive that I'm trying to get a, to run on the Kali Linux. So when this doesn't work, most people go to USB settings. You kind of add the filter here and you go to the name of the USB. You hit OK. You will restart and it will not, it will still not show here because this is kind of not detected here so my method will allow you to run your usb so without any long introduction let's go ahead and get going first of all you're going to need to shut down your kali and then go to your favorite browser in your browser it doesn't really matter you Google VBox Oracle and then you go to download and right here instead of downloading the virtual box software you're gonna come down here and download the virtual box extension pack today is um, I believe it's Thursday, March 17th, 2017. So um, today's date, up to today's date, this is exactly what the pack is, 5.0.16. You're gonna go ahead and hit all supported platforms and you save this file to your favorite location. And as you can see down here, I already have it. So what we need to do right now, just go your, to your download folder and double click on that package you just downloaded and it's going to prompt you and ask you to install that you're going to install it so all you have to do is hit install and scroll down so you can hit the button agree your administrator password here is necessary to allow the extension pack to be installed you hit ok and before we start our Kali we need to go to settings, go to ports, USB, and down here, make sure you use one of these two, either USB 2.0 or USB 3.0. It really depends on your um, operating system or maybe on your the on your computer and the USB type you have. I'm running a MacBook Pro. Um, I believe it's a 2013 edition. So you make sure you mark the USB. 2.0 that's in my case you add the filter and then you hit ok and you go ahead and start your virtual machine and hopefully right now you will be able to get your USB flash drive detected on your virtual machine so that you can do all the work you want to do with it you go ahead and log in I want to show you something here that is very important my USB is still detected on basically it's still running on the MacBook Pro and not on the virtual box the two machines cannot use the um, USB flash drive at the same time which means you have to eject it from one operating system so that the other can have access to it so I'm going to go ahead and hit eject. 
and it should show up somewhere over here within the next few seconds. Right there. There you go. You log into it. Same files are here. So now you will be able to run or to access your USB flash drive from your virtual machine. So now that your USB is detected on the virtual machine, if you go to devices and go to USB, it is now detected as you can see. Also, if you go to USB settings, you will see that it's running on the USB 2.0. Thank you for watching. If you guys like the tutorial, please don't forget to share, like, and subscribe to my channel for more videos to come. Thank you very much.